Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and online television. I am famously known for That Celebrity Interview, where I conduct interviews all over the globe by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash ValderBeebeShow, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder Beebe Show channel. I'll see you there. Well, happy holidays, Dr. Carrie Peterson. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I am fine, and I'm doing a countdown with my audience. It's getting exciting. It's almost Christmas, and I know you have good information for us. I certainly do. I have lots of tips for the family. That's right. All right, then. So let's get our family started. What do you have? So first, you know, kids tend to get colds and flu this time of year. As a mom myself, uh, I know how challenging it can be. And one problem is that kids can't blow their nose on their own. So there's this great handy device that was made. It's called the Nose Frida. It's non-invasive and it's hygienic. You put a tube just against the baby's nostril and on the other end is a mouthpiece and you, the mom or dad or caretaker can just suck on the mouthpiece and it pulls the mucus out of the baby's nose there's a filter there so it doesn't get in your mouth, don't worry, and it works really, really well. There's another th device that I found really handy. It's called the Fever Frida, and basically, you know, when a child is sick, you don't necessarily want to wake them in the middle of the night to check their temperature. I certainly don't. And what this is is a little patch that you put on the baby's arm, and it connects to a Bluetooth monitor, and it reads the temperature throughout the night, and it will alert you on your smartphone if the temperature goes above a preset level. So it can be very convenient, and it even is connected to the iCloud. So if you need to, you can even monitor your child's temperature outside of the home. So these Love are just that. great things. Yeah. Parents have so many availability of devices to keep their children well. Do you have anything else for us? I sure do. So at the first sign of a cold, being that there's no cure for a cold, I do recommend taking cold ease lozenges. They've been clinically found to reduce the duration of your cold by almost half, which is fantastic. And they also have a multi-symptom relief lozenge that works for both cold and flu symptoms. And new this season, they have a gummy which tastes really good. And other tips that I recommend are to make sure that you wash your hands regularly. And if you don't have access to soap and water, I recommend Wet Ones Hand Wipes. They kill 99.99% .99 of germs. And plus, they work better than a hand sanitizer because they also wipe away dirt and grime. They're also hypoallergenic and have aloe in them, so they're not drying like hand sanitizers are. And you can see they come in all different sizes, very convenient, so you can put them in your car or your purse or your backpack. And you can learn more about these at wetones.com. Parents have to stay healthy to take care of the kids. That's a great opportunity. Okay, so we're going to be all fresh and, and healthy for the holidays. Anything else? Uh, just make sure you get your flu shot if you haven't already. That's a great tip, Dr. Kerry. You know, we hadn't talked about that much, and it's really cold. That's a great tip. Thank you so much. I have a, hope you have a very happy holiday. Happy holidays to you also. Bye-bye.